गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल और इफ यू वॉचिंग माई चैनल फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम वेलकम टू माई चैनल एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग सो आज का वीडियो होने वाला है अबाउट माई बॉक्सी चाम एंड बॉक्सिंग ये सो फाइनली आई गॉट माई बॉक्सी चाम फॉर द पास्ट मंथ एंड इफ यू गाइज फॉलो मी ऑन इंस्टाग्राम दिन यू गाइज नो दैट आई रिसीव इट अराउंड टू और थ्री डेज बैक बट आई वॉज लेजी नॉट टू शूट an unboxing video but i was quick enough to open my box and see all the products that i have and i swatched them kind of swatched them not all of them i kind of swatched them and i really like them so uh, if you guys don't know about boxy charm then it is a us based monthly subscription box and you get over a 100 dollar price of products with after you pay 21 dollars each month and i think it's a good deal and uh, they don't ship to india but uh, I get mine through ship out from USA and if you guys don't know about ship out ship out from USA then it is a site actually and they create a virtual address your virtual address in US and then they will uh, get the uh, boxy charm for you and then you can get it from there yeah so that is the whole deal that is how I get my boxy charm and I had my 6 month a uh, subscription subscription with a boxy charm and this is the last this is my last subscription box I'm not sure if I will be like redoing it for the next month but i will be purchasing it again but not next month as i have done a stupid crazy sephora shopping and i am totally broke right now so <laughs> girl this happens so if you are interested to know what i have in my this month's boxy charm then let's keep on watching okay so you guys know that last time when i got my boxy charm it was torn from a side and two of the products were missing so i Uh, mail them i mail boxy charm and i mail ship out from usa and both of them they are both darlings actually because they both took extra special care of my box this time you'll get you guys will see you see this is my box and oh sorry so this time my box came with an extra cushion padding i think it is because they didn't want anything else to get out this month and also from ship out uh, ship out from usa i mailed them too and even they got my box in a big packet and wrapped it tightly so that it won't get torn anywhere on the way so anyways <laughs> so let's start with the unboxing this month's theme is downtown char and uh, they have all the things listed behind this card i'll be doing it step wise now uh, the first one is botanic fiber facial mask beauty secret oh my god okay so these masks three sheets mask by biobel cosmetics and they retail for 14.97 dollars so approximately 15 dollars so we'll be starting with these sheet masks there are three in it and i really don't know how to open it so these are the three sheet masks and uh, one is with pomegranate and hyaluronic acid another one is with wild rose and vitamin c and this one is with tea tree oil rose hip hip extract and vitamin c okay so this one is a priming sheet primer perfecting primer sheet mask oh i like this one i will be keeping this one for my special occasions this one is with rose and vitamin c i think i'm i'll be going with this one so let's just open this one up Oh my god it is like dripping with serum I love it Oh my god it fits my face perfectly I mean I have my uh, face shop masks but they never fit me so perfectly I mean I don't even have to see in a mirror to know that it fits perfectly Oh my god my hair I will be leaving this mask for 15 to 20 minutes peel off the mask and wipe off the excess liquid then proceed to rinse and apply moisturizer to your of your preference okay that is like weird and the hair tie okay so i just thought that now that uh, i have my mask on why don't i open up some other product and the next product that i have with me is this uh, real her number 1 eyeshadow palette i guess and uh, this is the palette now i have swatched some of these 
and they do apply beautifully like these are nicely pigmented uh, these are the swatches of two shades like smart uh, this one is smart the jet black one and this one is called unique and uh, i really like this smart black jet black color i think it is beautiful it is nicely pigmented and it does blend out very quickly so i really like uh, this palette i am using it for the past two days and i'm really loving it uh, i was just thinking that now that i'm sitting here why don't i just create a eye look using this palette as i'm sitting idly and i'm doing nothing so why don't create a look so today i'll be going i'll be trying this creative shade and let's see how it goes let's just take this cover off and it is a nice clear mirror it's a nice mirror i'll be starting with the black all over my eye that I could see okay, it is not simple to get enough for the mask on I'm taking some fix plus we go to going in this creative color this strong color and I will be putting it in my crease okay so I have my lid shade on and I need a pop of color I would like to have a pop of color on the center of my lip so I will be going with this uh, fun shade let's just do my lower lash line because why not let's just take another color let's just take this courageous one here let's just take it and apply it to my lower lash line I really like the uh, names that they have given to their shades it is like very you know what's the word for it very encouraging you know uh, this is it for the eyes. I will be completing them once I take this mask off. Uh, the third thing that I have with me is this Ofra Long Lipstick. <laughs> Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. And this retail for $19.90. And this is in the shade. This is shade. Okay. It does not have the shade nom name on it. I guess it is Santa Anna because that is what this card says Santa Anna. So it should be Santa Anna. Ooh. It has a nice smell, and the formula is a bit different than I, than I expected. Like it is not like a completely liquid lipstick, it is it has a moussey texture to it. And it does smell like our Lakme 9 to 5. I like the color. I mean, you guys know I love my browns and berries. So it's a nice berry shade. Okay guys, so I have done my eyes off camera. I have applied mascara and some eyeliner. And you know what happened? I mixed a little bit of essential oil in my eyeliner. It, I was using a gel eyeliner. And it was getting dry, so I mixed a little bit of it, a little bit of oil in it. And then I put it in my lower lash line. And oh my god. Now, it is not recommended. I'm telling by my experience. It is not recommend, recommended to put an essential oil mixed with liner in your lower lash line oh my god it like my eyes they started watering so bad that i felt like i'll have to redo, redo the look again anyways <laughs> that was a bad move by me it is more than 20 minutes actually so i will be taking this mask off i am going to wipe it off whatever excess is there 
just wipe it. And it is a nice mask. It does give me a softer feeling skin, smoother skin. Okay. Uh, so if you guys know, uh, it was in the last two last month's box. I mean, like it was in May's box. It was this uh, Temp2 highlighter. And it was a collaboration between Temp2 and uh, Boxy Charm. It is a liquid highlighter and uh, I didn't get it last month as it was all open up and was poof. So I don't know the exact price of it. I will be leaving it, uh, I will be writing it down in my description box. So I will be starting uh, my face by applying this to my face. Uh, I know that it can be mixed uh, in your foundation. Oh my God, it's like liquid. So good. It is leaking, but it is so good. So I wanna do it in that Instagram kind of a style. So I'll be doing it like that and see what happens. And I have a beautiful right away. See, I'm crying. It is thick. I don't know. Let's just see how it goes. Okay, guys. So I have almost completed my face. Like I, um, like after that highlighter, that Temp2 highlighter, I applied some foundation and some bronzer, and that is my eyebrows, of course. And that is actually what I do all. No, actually, the last two things. Hello. Hello. Namaste, Mami Jane. Catch you. Or without. So, anyways, the last two things that I have in the box is this Artist Couture Diamond Glow Powder in the shade Illuminati, and this Luxie 640 Pro Precision Tapered Brush. And mine is a bit twisted, but that's okay. Nothing that a wash can't handle. The brush cost for twenty four dollars and this artist couture powder is for 26.99 and i was really excited about this one this is a liquid um, sorry this one is a powdered highlighter and box and like boxy charm is giving highlighter in almost every month now like the first one was the vintage i got the first one was the vintage by i don't remember the name exactly i'll put it down in the description box it was the vintage uh, du uh, duo highlighter then uh, the next one was uh, my favorite Ofra Rodeo Drive. Third one was this Temp 2. And this is the fourth highlighter that I'm getting in my six months subscription box. So that is actually good. So this is the powder. Oh my God. Can you guys, like, can we just take a moment and appreciate this? It is such a beautiful, beautiful highlight. Whatever is there, uh, like I'll be taking whatever is there in the brush, in the top, and that is also too much. I like this. Oh, <laughs> did you guys see that? Oh my God, that is like, poof. <laughs> that one, that went everywhere. I will try not to be too crazy with it, as it is a big brush. I really hope that you guys can see this is such a beautiful golden highlight and I really like this one I will be taking a smaller brush now for my inner corners my eyebrow my nose now oh, it started raining okay I'm taking a very little amount of it on a tiny teeny brush And the lighting is now going to be so bad. As you guys know, I shoot in natural light and now there are like clouds in the sky and there is no light. So please excuse the lighting. Please. I 
really want to try this on my shoulder. So let's just see how it works with this big brush on my shoulder. It's a good highlight. Highlight. It's artist couture. Charm ship out from USA and everything that they have in this box down below. I will be mentioning the total cost of it down below. And uh, I really like this month's boxy charm. Actually, I like every month's boxy charm that I've got. I liked it every month. And um, I'm a big fan of boxy charm. I can't help it. And if you're watching, Martin, nay, Joseph. And if you're watching, Joseph Martin, I love you. Please, please start shipping to uh, India directly so that I don't have to. All the kharcha, you know. <laughs> okay, thank you so much for watching, you guys, and I'll see you guys later. Mwah.